This is Oakwood Cemetery in Huntsville, Texas. And we're here today to see the Black Jesus statue, which is supposed to be haunted. Let's go see if we can find it. I think I found the haunted black Jesus statue. I'm looking right now at the front gate where I came in. And I walked right down here. And here is a sign with the history. And it's hard to see in the dark down there, but that's it. This is the Powell Sanctuary. And this says Powell. And the family put up this statue. It was a bronze statue originally. And they put it up because their five-year-old died in Austin, Texas from tonsil surgery. Here's the Powell's. Now this, right in front of the statue, is the headstone. It's hard to read out here in the dark. Raleigh, rather Powell, 1918 to 19... 23 and at the bottom it says Powell peace leave with you let not your heart be troubled neither let it be afraid They have some benches out here. See if we can go behind it. They have a poem. The Trees and the Master. It's kind of long, I won't read it. But it's by Sidney Lanier. This is the back. Now the story of the statue is it was bronze to begin with and to turn black and the two stories on why it turned black were the first one was that lightning hit it 
the second one was because of all the sun coming through all the trees. On this side it says, this wild wood was dedicated as a sanctuary in loving memory of our dear child Raleigh Rather Powell on July 17th, 1925. This is a view from the side. Now the haunted part of this, besides the color of the bronze statue turning black, the other part of it is the way the hands Way that, the way the hands are right now, they're down. The palms are facing down. But if you come up here at night, the palms turn up. And also, the eyes are supposed to follow you around. Now, I'm not going to come out here at night. But it's an awesome statue. The other part of it is people touch the feet. And it paints, uh, it, it's all uh, turning back to the original. Kind of looks green down here on this part of it. Once again, this was put up for the child who died at five years old. Now to get here, you have to go down this walkway. And there's the road that goes by. And you can see the front gate where the car is. And this is a recorded Texas Historic Landmark in 2015. Straight down the path is where we saw the Black Jesus statue. As you walk out to the road,
see the rathers. And from the road, this is what it looks like. You can see the marker. On this side, it's Morse. 